Hello everyone, this is Wolf Hakase. When I started this channel, my initial plan was to add videos of multiple games. So far I've only made videos for Digimon Heroes, but today we're gonna change that. Terraria is what we're playing today, version 1.3.2.1. To be completely honest, I already made two videos today. And I made a new chapter, and a new world, and I explained some things. And then I watched back, and I forgot to record sound. So, I'm gonna try again. <laughs> I've already played about 150 plus hours, so I think I know what I'm doing. Um, let's make a... Uh, yeah, well, we're gonna play single player, and as you can see I've already got a couple of, of characters. The one I created this morning I deleted already, and I'm gonna make a new one. And I don't really care for character creation, so I'm just gonna press random until I see something I kind of like. I will choose a man. Ah, that's okay. Um, I'm gonna go for softcore. Uh, for the people who don't know what that is, softcore characters drop money on death, medium core drop items and money, and hardcore die for good. Normally I play medium core, but I don't think it's entertaining to see me run back to where I died to get all my stuff again every time because I'm planning wait I'm calling him wolf Hakase. I'm planning on also making a new world which is gonna be a large expert world wolf Hakase. expert uh, expert yeah what that means is that the loot that will be dropped will be better, but the world will be really hard. Um, in my previous two videos that I made... Oh, Crimson again? Okay, so in the last try I did, I also got Crimson. There's also this thing called uh, Corruption. And they have different uh, items that drop, different bosses, and different uh, monsters. Basically. Uh, if you want to know more, then... Either ask in the comments and I'll, I'll explain something. Or look it up on a wiki. Because there's a very extensive wiki for Terraria. I mean, Terraria has been out since 2011. So... Um, and the, the wiki has been kept up to date. And, and every version has new things in it. For Terraria, of course. And then, obviously, the wiki gets updated with the, that information too. So... And then the, the, well, everyone who has seen a wiki for a game knows how it works. But it's basically on the same level as the Minecraft wiki, which is also pretty good. Um, yeah, I'll favor this world and let's start playing. Okay. So the first thing we'll do, and probably the only thing in this video, is we'll make a house. As you can see, we have another dude running around. Uh, that's an NPC. He is the guide. And the first thing we do, as I said, is make a house. But not just a house for ourselves, but also a house for NPCs. Um, I'm not planning on explaining everything about this game, because this is basically a playthrough and not really a tutorial. Um, but yeah, what you want to do is make houses so that NPCs can move in. There are 22 NPCs in total, and they will only appear if you make them a house. Actually, I'm gonna change the sound settings, because I think the sound is a bit loud. Oh, it's actually pretty low already. Yeah, it's maybe a bit softer. Yeah, 50. It needs to be exactly 15 because because else I get uh, a bit neurotic. Okay, make this flat. And uh, you can talk to this guy and then he gives you uh, explanations about what to do. But I don't really care. Oh, that was not what I wanted. That was not what I wanted. That was not what I wanted. Okay. So this goes up. And this goes that way. Oh, I needed to count it. Keep forgetting to count. Okay, well, I'm gonna start a second story <laughs> so that I can count. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I do apologize. My neighbors are making noise again, as they often do. Um, I don't really know what they're doing, but they're making noise often. Mostly during the week, but now it's weekend and they still do it. Um, how big do I want to make this? Ah, make it four. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so I don't really care about aesthetics. So I'm not going to make the most beautiful thing ever. But what I will do is this. I will get more wood. I will make a house with the, the, the lowest floor will be my base. And the floors on top of that will be houses for the NPCs. Uh, now the houses with, for the NPCs have a door on the inside only because NPCs tend to get go out of their house and walk around. Um, and at night, terrible things spawn, monsters and whatnot. So you don't really want your NPCs to be outside. So to prevent them from going outside, I make it so that it's difficult for them to do so. So I'll place some doors. So like, oh, let me do one lower. This, and this, that, and that. I don't have enough wood. Let's get some more. Ooh, that was not really... uh, yep. And this. Oh, that's a. Is that a tree? That's close to my house. That's amazing, actually. Oh, normally they're hollow. Ah, I'll I'll have to check that out later. Um. So yeah. I'll just quickly make a, a quick house so that we're safe when night comes. And then I'll do some exploring. And after exploring, well, while exploring, we'll find new items and then I'll well, get progressively better. Right. What a house needs to be valid is a set um, minimum room, ro yeah, minimum room, minimum space. Uh, oh, I'm out. Uh, a light source for which we need torches, um, a chair, and a table. So I'm making two houses to start with. One for the guide. And one for the merchant, because when you reach 50 silver, the merchant arrives. And we're already at 12 copper. 100 copper is one silver. Um, so yeah, he, he'll probably be the first one to arrive. The nurse is also pretty quick to arrive. Uh, she comes when you get 120 health. Um, I might get a demolist first. I, did, I had that in my last run because he arrives as soon as you find um, explosives. Um, I'm making some. Yeah, I'm excavating a bit here because I'm, I'm gonna place my chest here anyway. So I may as well load some dirt to make the back, um, the, the, the wall for my house. In this uh, kind of world, the the expert mode, daytime is actually, it seems to be shorter. I haven't looked up whether it actually is, but it seems to be. And the nighttime actually seems longer. Um, at night, monsters spawn, as I already said. Uh, among these are zombies. Those are the most common ones. And normally, they are pretty harmless. But in expert mode, they can actually open doors. So even when you have a house, they can still be a pain. 
So, this side. Right, place some torches. And here too. Oh, other torches. Can never have too many. Uh, in order to make torches, you need wood and slime, and slime get, oh, gel, actually. And gel gets dropped by slimes. That's right. I did that so that I could make more torches. So that I can light up this space. Right. Okay, like that. Um... Yeah, I'll place torches here already. It's not really needed yet, but I'll do it anyway. Um, yeah, now I'm gonna quickly get this iron. That's one of the ores in the game. It's basically like Minecraft. Um, you, you just gather ores and um, as you get further in the game, you make different items. Um, which then make it make you able to get other ores, uh, copper. Okay. Oh, more copper here. Um, that that's not really easy to reach. I'll have to dig. I'd rather just go there with um, ropes or something, but I don't have ropes yet. Do have to pay attention to that slime over there because he might try to fall on top of me, and then I'm gonna die. So, to prevent that, oh, that's not what I wanted. To prevent that, I'm just doing this. Because then he can fall into the hole and won't be able to reach me. As you can see, it works. My plan is successful. So, my items aren't too bad, they're just basic. In my last run, I had an axe with a modifier that was uh, annoying. Literally, it was the annoying modifier. Um, yeah, that was not fun. It was literally annoying. Ah, torches. I was actually hoping for rope. Come on. Yeah. Oh man, it's just not high enough for me. Hey, rope. 31 rope. That makes it a hell of a lot easier to get out of here. Um, where did I, okay. Yeah, that worked. And uh, now, can I do this? Sure. Ooh. Oh, huh, huh, Ooh. Um, what's that? Is that, is this the ore? Or is it something else? I don't even know what it is. Oh, it's iron, okay. And more copper. Oh, there's a lot of stuff around my house. I like it. Ooh. I hope the slime leaves me alone. And it does. Of course. Yeah. This pickaxe is actually the strongest weapon I have right now because the short sword you start with is absolute garbage. Um, it's not even dependent on the, the modifiers it has. Regardless of the modifiers, it's it's garbage. Oh man, stop hitting me. If you had hands, I would do the why are you hitting yourself thing, but this has a type of revenge. Oh man, I don't have any healing items. Oh, I do. Ha, huh, I just healed. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go home because it's getting dark. And you don't want to be out on your first night. I mean, unless you already found amazing weapons or something, but I didn't, <laughs> so I'm just gonna stay home. Did I actually check if my housing was valid? I think I didn't check that, because it could be that I made it to... Oh, I actually already, I actually already claimed one. In that case, it's fine. Um, oh, I don't have chests yet. Yeah, if you don't have a chest, you can ditch your items. You can ditch your items. Yeah. Language is hard. I don't know if I've ever told anyone that, but language is hard. 
especially if it's your second language. Uh, yours, or third, or fourth. English is only my second, though. I do speak some other languages, but not well. <laughs> I mean, I'm Dutch, so I, I understand. I understand some German. Uh, I wouldn't say I speak it, but I understand it. Uh, not all of it, but German and Dutch are kind of similar, so I understand part of it. And then, of course, you have French, French, because I, we, well, it's it's mandatory in school in the Netherlands. Um, so I had some. Uh, I, have, I have some. Uh, oh man, stay inside. I have some French knowledge, but it's really not much. And I'm trying to learn Japanese, but I've been trying to do that for a long time, and I didn't really do it well because I never really put enough time in it. Actually, I do speak some languages. Why was I talking about the languages I speak again? Yeah, I get off track sometimes. Um, I'm just gonna have to wait this one out because I'm just not strong enough to be able to beat a zombie and a flying eye. I could do some digging, that's what I could do. Um, that's what I will do, in fact. Did I make. Uh, no, I didn't make any more platforms. I should. star. If I wasn't afraid to go outside, I would totally go. Yeah, I'm just gonna make the second layer of my uh, chest uh, storage compartment thingy. Uh, story. Yeah. Ooh, there's stuff here. Guess so. Claim that. Actually, I already have quite a lot of iron for how long I've been playing. In the last place, I have less. But my world didn't have iron. <laughs> yeah, I, what, wh whether you get iron or something else is random. Um, there's only gonna be one of those types of uh, ore available in your world. So, uh, apparently this world has iron, uh, that is, yeah, that's fine. They're all pretty much the same, honestly. So it doesn't really matter. Yeah, um, yeah, what you want to do in Terraria is just dig straight down. In, in Minecraft, for example, you don't want to do that because you're falling into lava. But in Terraria, that is not really a danger because lava only appears at a really low levels, um, at the lowest two types of uh, biomes. So it's not really a problem. Uh, I only have 19 rope. So I do have to pay attention to how deep I go. Oh, that was not something I wanted to do. So I can actually go one deeper. Ooh, one. Um, and then as far as I can jump, of course. Yeah, let's just... Why not? Oh, I should set down at the torch so that I can actually see something. Yeah, I'm going to be. <laughs> Whoops. But we have platforms. Ugh, halfway. Only halfway. Yeah. Um, well, I have to wait, I guess. I mean, 
later on when I'll uh, build part of the of the next floor. I guess. I can't really go outside because of the demon eye thingies. Yeah, if we go to a lower um, floor, then maybe they'll follow. Maybe. And that should give me some time to get up and build something. See, now it can't get in anymore. get that. Um, can I? I can try. I can do this. Oh, come on. And then I do this. And I load them down here again. any healing items. Great. Oh, I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna make it. Yeah! Alright! I'm so not a noob. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, absolutely. Keep telling yourself that. Um, actually, if I stand here, I could try to beat those guys. Although, Getting rid of the door wasn't a smart decision, but I can always hide in that new room. <gasps> oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm not really at that point where I'm starting to collect lenses, but if I can get lenses, so I'm, I'm not complaining, obviously. Um, so yeah, the demon eyes drop lenses, and if you have six, you can use those to create an item with which a boss can be spawned. Um, the first one you normally encounter. But, yeah, I can barely be humanized. So, let alone the Eye of Cthulhu, the boss you can spawn. Okay, finish this. Great. And I have one torch. Can I have more torches? do. Um, there's that. Place the door. Um, this. Oh, that was not great. That is not great. That is not great. Okay, that's great. Yeah, what the fuck was that? Why did he do that? Oh, weird. Um, oh, that's a strange plan, isn't it? Yeah, alright. That means that the Die NPC is gonna be spawning soon. Um, which also means that I have to get the next room ready. Because we do want to get all the NPCs as soon as we can, of course. Alright, next. Now I'll make some more. starting to get day because I don't see the moon anywhere and that only means that it's about time you can use your pickaxe to dig through the dirt and your axe to chop down trees just place your cursor over the tile and click if you want to survive you will need to create weapons and shelter Start by chopping down trees and gathering wood. Ah, it's day. Um, I don't even know why I'm doing this. I'm not gonna follow them. I'm not gonna follow them. No, I'm not gonna follow them. If I would, I would die because they would still kill me. Get 
bring some more wood. Then I can make some furniture. And then as soon as I have 50 silver, uh, the merchant embassy can also appear. Is my axe slowing down? Um, actually, what I should do is plant some of the acorns. Because I've already chopped down quite a lot of trees. Um, you may need more uh, in the near future. That should do for now. Um, hey, there's a silver coin in him. After the next... Whoa, 25 silver coins? Holy sh... That's a lot. Well, for now. <laughs> in, in the future, it's gonna be nothing. Alright. Um, we're gonna need... Well, let's make four chairs for now. Uh, four tables. Jump, jump. Crisscross is gonna make you jump, jump. Okay. Get rid of that, get rid of that. And place. Oh, I need to craft more. Tick, tick. Uh huh, uh huh. See? The die trader has arrived. Great. Hmm. I forgot to make uh, doors. It's not a valid house if it doesn't have doors. Uh, I could, however, make this count as one house instead of two, because for some reason, platforms count as doors. Yeah, I know. What the fuck? Um, place the walls. Is great. Place it next to a light, which isn't actually needed, but I just like it. Just looks better that way. Uh, add more walls, and that's not enough. Doesn't matter. Alright. And create more wall. More, 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 more. Jump, jump, jump. Okay. Oh, and I forgot to make the doors again. Um, there they are. I only four. Yeah, I always prefer to make a little thingy on top of my house so that I can get out in case of emergencies. So, like this, like that, and then. Oh, no, that is totally not what I wanted to do. Oh, man. Okay, good. Um, yeah, so what I do is this and that. Get rid of those. Place this. Um, fill it in. Great. And place torches. And I also prefer to do this on every level, on both sides. Um, again, so that when you want to get out or get in through another way, you have that option. Um, that does mean, however, as you already saw with that one zombie that jumped on top of it, that enemies can also get up there, which in some cases can be dangerous. Here, I'll give you a strange plant and I get three die. The die I can put in these slots, but Right now they don't really do anything, only when you have uh, actual I mean, uh, armor, I forgot, I forgot that word. <laughs> um, oh man, that dog. Uh, let's see, how long have we been recording? Oh, that's half an hour. Yeah, I'm gonna wrap up the first episode here. Um, let me know what you thought of it. Um, share, like, uh, rate, that kind of thing. Um, 
subscribe if you haven't done so. Um, feedback, feedback is welcome in your comments, of course. Um, if you have questions about the game, also leave those in the comments and I'll answer them. Um, yeah, I'm hoping to make uh, a series out of this. Uh, pretty much 30 minutes per episode. Sometimes longer, sometimes shorter. We'll try to do as little editing as I can because I don't really like to edit and I am not really good at it yet. So there's that. Um, yeah, thanks for watching and I'm going to leave you here. See ya.